Jo, blöd. I do have to say, if you have any contraband, you can tell that us now. No, and we don't have to go through the uh, trouble. Is uh, this contraband a uh, plate carrier from a faction uh, that is your enemy? But uh, he, the person who no. was wearing it was killed, and I took it from him. Yeah, yeah that's contraband. So, oh yeah, well, there you go. Oh, good night, plate carrier. That's a shame. Yeah, just shit anyway. Is this your first time in Junkyard? Yes, it is. Awesome. So, what we got to meet is maybe some. Uh, uh, Pyro guys, blood sack. Like uh, yeah, yeah, inform him on the potential mutants, man. Oh, that's that's good. I actually tell him like full potential mutants we can fall. Yeah, we can find a burrow, we can find a controller. Really, 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 I came out. So just listen to us and you should be fine. Will do. Uh, this is a really bad time to tell you boys to die. I need to quickly go do something in my head. Oh, fuck, shit, what a red. Come back there. I really need to go through this, I don't have a choice. Let's take uh, two minutes, three over here, huh? Wish. Da, da, da. I'll be back in literally a minute. Cat. Actress, kill the fucking cats. Bestie, your hood's fucked up. Oh shit, kids. Yeah. Oh, I fucking hope they didn't get Electros. Fix your hood. I have good Electros. Son. Oh shit. Oh, your hood's fucked up too. What a fucking time, huh? That, that, no, I'm just, I don't see colors, man. Open checkpoint first, and then we go to East Factory. Oh uh, no, let's do Factory first at the close. Cat. Holy fuck! You good? The best took post. I think the best took everything because it didn't really hurt. It just scratched me a little. Alright, cut this fucking thing up when we talk about it when we get the holy shit, bestie. You almost killed my best friend, man. What the? Oh, that was an accident. He ran into my. Oh, no, holy shit. Yeah, sorry. Nah, I have yeah, to yeah, apologize, brother. Nah. I am meant to stand still, too. Dude, we can do self hate and. Self humiliation later. We have a task to do. Uh, don't worry, we'll humiliate you down in paradise. Eh, that's okay. That's kind of what I expect from my friends. Splitters, I think I see a pyro. Oh, there's oh, a pyro. Yeah, that's the junk pile. 
He's going to come down as soon as we start shooting, so do we kill him first or kill him yeah, after? Yeah, we have to. In? He's going to come. No, he's going to come. And if we're not done with the bloodsack, because we have nowhere to run, we have to deal with him first. But, uh, uh, well, uh, bestie, this is time for shotgun, mate. Uh, you kill Pyro with shotgun. Uh, uh, no, mine's too short range, so I'm going to have to use AK, but... Uh, the Alright boys, we're just going to have Let's the W line, line up a little so that uh, we uh, are a bit spread and then we can just stop blasting. We'll bring him to us. up because we can have blood suckers coming right at they uh, will not be running but they will leave their uh, place of course yes. i need to look top up you know i only have yeah uh, me too me too all right best if ain't gonna lie this polter really got me monoly i'm joking no no don't shoot don't shoot he's fucking joking dude yeah i'm joking but I'm still I tempted know. to shoot him. Go. Okay. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay, let's... Uh... I'm not gonna lie, I really like the way I look now. <laughs> yeah, besides your ugly fucking face, it's very... very soothing. You want to get stabbed at the, you want to get stabbed in the nose, Busty? I'm kidding, I would never do that to you. I only shot you no. in the ass once. Yeah, that was a binding moment for okay. both of us. <laughs> hey, choo, choo. Hey. I shot them in the ass, and then I had to remove the bullet with my knife. And I'm pretty sure he got hepatitis from it. And a little boner, but that's... that's that? uh, okay, yeah, I think I he's doing bad things. Well, I had a little boner as well, so it's okay, you know, as long as it's consensual, it's legal. Yeah, it was a uh, no homo. Well, not no, very no, homo. No homo, no homo. No. And yeah, you're you wearing know. socks anyways. <laughs> I've got a little bit more... Uh, Yeah, like if they don't accept help when I ask, like say, do you want to know anything about radiation? And then they say, no, I know everything there is to know. Then I say, fuck you, go die. But I think we can all do it. I know most of y'all. I know you all to be some of the most capable men and women I've ever met. I think, uh, I'm a man of few words, but I think you guys are about ready. I think we're about ready to finally finish this thing once and for all. You all with me? You ready to code kill this sucker? Right. No. Fuck yeah! yeah. Fuck yeah! yeah. <laughs> kill an idiot! Let's fucking kill this thing. Yeah, I hope that's ready. Okay, before, uh, uh, yeah. before we set to it, I've asked our resident preacher, Basti, to say a few words, and then after which, Chris will give a, well, it's unfortunately not going to be too, too long or an in-depth a lesson, but for some of you loaders, a bit of a crash course in, uh, well, firearm safety. It ain't like running with the packs you'd normally run with, two or three loaders. There's going to be a lot of people on either side, to your left, to your right, in front, behind. So we're going to have to make sure we keep everyone safe, not just from the swamp monster, but, well, from ourselves. So, uh, Basti, where are you at? I'm here. Up here. Yeah, he's ready already. Good, good. Take it away, Basti. Alright, brothers and sisters. I see a lot of you today. And I have to say, I'm proud. Not just because you all hear the call, but because for a few minutes, maybe a few hours, we will forget all the struggle and all the grief you hold it to each other. I see mercenaries standing shoulder to shoulder with duty. I see ecologists standing next to clear sky. Priest stalkers and loners. We are all here united by a common cause. Caesar already told you 
that we don't know what you are going to face, and neither do I. I hold my dear and holy Bible, and I have read it back, forth, up, down, left and right. And none of it, uh, in none of the chapters I found something about monsters that swallow people. But it's not important. Important is, you heeded the call and you have shown your great courage even to show up here. And you show great courage in the field facing off against the forces of evil. Some of you will not make it. But if you go in heaven and knock on the door, you can say, yeah, I may have flashed my flesh prison, but I died fighting and I died for just cause. I sadly cannot join you today, but I know that you all are the most capable, brave, courageous and capable fellas the zone has shown us. My heart is with you, my mind is with you, and I ask God for your hearts to be filled with courage, for your trigger fingers to be trained, for your eyes are sharp and your bullets aim, uh, meet their aim. So, not to drag this long because Christian has some very much more important things than I have to say. I want to end this with the most brave, brazen words spoken in recent history. Russian warship, Iri Nahui. May God guide and guard you all. In the name of the Father, the Son and the Holy Ghost. Amen. Amen.